हरे कृष्णा वॉट वी इनिशियली इंडल्ज इन कैजुअली वी इवेंचुअली इंडल्ज इन कंपल्सिवली ड्यूरिंग द कोर्स ऑफ आर लाइफ वी आर ऑफन टेम्पटेड बाय मैनी डिजायर्स एंड यू फील दिस इंडल्जेंस वॉट्स द बिग डील आई जस्ट ईट समथिंग आई वॉच समथिंग आई टच समथिंग आई बाय समथिंग वॉट्स द बिग डील येस समटाइम्स इट मे नॉट बी अ बिग डील बट समटाइम्स इट कैन बिकम अ बिग डील वाई because whatever actions we do they get impressed in our mind and those impressions then come up as propositions and the more frequently we do a particular thing the stronger the more forceful that proposition comes coming that's why when somebody takes a drink initially so they may just casually drink oh all my friends are drinking let me drink once so what we initially may indulge in casually what happens that next time again the desire comes let's drink and next time the desire comes it becomes stronger and it becomes further stronger and within within a short time that person may find themselves addicted that person may become an alcoholic who is on the verge of wreck, wrecking their life because of their alcoholism so how does this happen because whenever we indulge between us and that object a shackle is formed a rope is formed and then every indulgence thickens that shackle and then we feel pulled by that shackle and the thicker the shackle the the more difficult it is to resist it krishna points to this in the bhagavad gita when he says asha paashishatair baddha kama krodha parayana ihante kama bhogartham anyayenartha sanchayan This is asha paashisha tair baddha. We become bound by hundreds and thousands of desires, kama krodha parayana, because we give ourselves to desire and anger, and then ihante kama bhogartham. Because of the desire for sensual indulgence, anya ye nartha sanchayan, we give up ethical boundaries, we cross legal limits, and we start. going into forbidden territory eventually the shackles drag us into self destruction that's why when we understand that every action is a commitment to similar actions in future when we understand this then we won't indulge so nonchalantly so casually we will calmly and soberly evaluate whether an indulgence is desirable and whether that indulgence is entangling us when we have this mature discrimination then we can provide protect ourselves from a lot of unnecessary tribulation thank you hare krishna